change today. We're outside because it's nice and cool. Um, we're going to do the push-pull metabolic cervix. This is an awesome metabolic conditioning workout. I'm not sure how exactly long it will take me. There are four exercises. We're going to superset between a push and a pull uh, back and forth, and I'm going to change, change the reps 15, 12, 10, and 8 for the most part. Um, I'm not going to talk during this workout. I'm going to try to do a voiceover for this one just so I can push a little harder and um, show you exactly how hard you should be working. So make sure you're warm. If you're not warm, make sure you pause this, get warm, and then we can start together. Um, and we're going to start with the T-Rex pull-up. Just a quick little mention, if you don't have one of these, no problem. You can use your pull-up bar, which I would say 99% of the population probably has one. Assisted, uh, um, or sorry, a, a dip station um, that you can also buy online, or you can modify doing super mass, so lying on your stomach, lifting up and down. So that's obviously going to take the intensity down quite a bit. Um, so uh, if you could buy a pull-up bar or a TRX, this would be an awesome addition to your whole workout. So uh, let's get started. I'm going to start with 15 TRX pull-ups, and then I'm supersetting that with a push press using my sandbag, which is about 40 pounds. Make sure your weight is challenging enough so the last few reps are challenging. There's absolutely no rest during this workout, just the transitions as you'll be rest. Okay, so here I go, 15 pull-ups. Lead with your chest, space between your chin and your chest. Don't lock the elbow, make sure you have a full range of motion. This is just a small bend in the knee, not a squat. Keep your chest up. This is momentum, so the dumbbell, barbell, or sandbag gets above the head. These jumps are very quick, light on your feet. I do show an easier option at the end of the 30 reps. Back flat, chest up, the dumbbells come directly under the chest and straight down. Your hands have to be close to the wall. You do not want an arch in the lower back. Be very careful with these. Slight bend in the elbow if you can.
Get those knees up. Work hard. It's only 20 steps. Be sure that the weight you choose is challenging enough. The reps go down each round, so you have to make sure that the, those last few reps are challenging enough. The weights, barbell or sandbags, need to be very close to your face when bringing above your head. If these wall burpees are just too intimidating for you, some good push-ups will do the trick. Last round of all of these exercises, we're gonna push hard. 
The reps are down now, only 10 of each. Make sure your weight is challenging. Push yourself as hard as you can for this last set. Let's go. Your core needs to be strong. There should not be a lower back arch whatsoever. The big barbell dumbbells directly over your head. Neck is neutral to your spine. Keep pushing, we're almost done. Thumbs up, 30 seconds, probably not even. You've got 30 skips. I want you to go as fast as you can. Finish this circuit as strong as you can. Let's go.